Quite a few people have asked how you get in and out of the lengthwise pyramids. It's really not complicated. There will be two points on your tarp where there is a carabiner or something else that goes through two loops. Take one of those, unclip one of the loops and then you can lift it up and you can enter and exit. Also setting up the optional awning is not that hard. You find that same spot again where you have two tie outs and move one to the side. This is where you will put your guy line. Maybe you followed my advice and made this arrow point shape where you take the two flaps that are over and stake them away from the wind. In that case it's also not hard to get in and out. You reach in here, in this gap, and on the other side will be your carabiner. Unclip this one, lift it out, and you can enter and exit here. When you're inside or outside and want to close it, one hand from the outside, one hand from the inside. And that's really easy. And you've probably already spotted that making the optional awning this way is also really easy and is done in exactly the same fashion. This is the one you unclip. Go to the one next to it. This is where the guy line goes. Really easy. One of the perks of this method is that your opening will always be away from the winds because you made the arrow shape to point in the wind direction. Same thing for the star tent. The star tent is in essence a very simple pitch. First you stake the four corners and give them some slack. Then you put a pole in the middle until it goes no further up. Then your four sides will look sloppy and you can solve this either by staking them downwards or by staking them upwards. If you do three sides down and one side up, you will have a nice entrance. In the night, nothing prevents you from taking the side that you did up and stake it down to have a sheltered night. <laughs> 